we are what we eat. A core part of the pervasive lifestyle change in the land has been about what we eat. And I have a very deep concern that this dimension of lifestyle change portends a serious healthcare burden in some years ahead if care is not taken. Sometimes last year, my system was messed up so badly that I started wondering if I had a tumor or something somewhere in my gut. I tried a few drugs, but there was no real improvement. When it got to a head, I decided to shoot for an endoscopy, which revealed that my colon is in good shape. How can it be? And I still feel mostly uncomfortable. At some point, I resolved to eating only once a day. Sometimes not at all, but just water and tea. Then come a day of deliverance. Um, I had gone to a bookstore to get some gifts, and I spotted this book on diet by an American author. I picked it, and thank God I did. The revelation was stunning, but simple. My diet has comprised of too many wrong things and very few right things by virtue of lifestyle change. I was surprised that an American dietitian would recommend tubers over some of the grains that have dominated my diet. How was I to know that the cheap cassava is more suited to my system than the more expensive rice that came in all form of tasty flavors? The painful part for me, and this is because I love good food, was realizing that occasional fasting is healthy. As our system is not designed to just be eating the so-called three square meals every day of the year. I used to think a fruit is still a fruit is still a fruit. But of the truth, some fruits are better than others. And under certain circumstances, there are even some sugary fruits you want to avoid. A half glass of red wine is better than a bottle of the so-called sparkling fruity stuff and those sugary drinks we love so much. In one month of dietary change, and without any drugs, my miracle came, and my system was totally reset. Peace reigned in my gut. Of course, there will be occasional indulgences, um, but I have learned to skew my diet in favor of eating mostly the good stuff and less of the bad stuff. Our indigenous foods, a bowl of guinea meal, a mala and okra, or a bao itafan, pounded yam with vegetable soup, sweet potatoes, etc., are food items that your girls have evolved to love. Even if our woke emotions deceive us to see other sexy status symbol foods as delightful and delicious. On a general basis, most of the things they advertise to us to consume using cute models are actually killing us. My advocacy, there is serious healthcare burden ahead by virtue of our lifestyle change in food. Governments have a role to improve awareness on diets and nutrition. Individuals must also make it a point of duty to educate themselves or speak to experts on what they should consume more, those they should eat less of, and others they must avoid. We are what we eat, and it's teaching time saves nine. Were you still eating like you were a child or a teenager and expecting your gut to still freely digest those meals? Eh, you still wanted to have your sweet... No, no, but, but, okay, that's not the issue, really. You find out that um, uh, my first time in America, and I was like, ah, how come they know they show us picture of all these big, big people? When you watch their movie, they show you the slim tie. Yes, no. You know, and all mm. So it means you have big, big people here like this. Everything obese. in America is big. <laughs> and so they give you the impression that... You know, um, uh, when you eat their food, you'll be like this. And it became slim, now became the new heady. Um, if you are, you know, mm -hmm. um, a yard party, it means that uh, you are not, um, you know, heady. Uh, and then um, they use the opportunity to sell all kinds. And you see people drink different tea on empty stomach. Some will tell you, oh, don't cook with the normal pot that you cook with. You need to buy special pots. I told the lady, I said, come, I don't want my system to be too clean. That my... You need my, some, a little bit of rubbish. Yes, I don't, so that my 
antibodies will die of not having anything to fight. I don't want them to be like, uh, you know. What so I quickly, think, yeah. what, I, what I'm saying is, sometimes this narrative are intentionally created to drive markets. Are you, are you saying that I should stop eating my semo? No. Oh my. <laughs> no, <laughs> honestly, semo is very important too. Oh. <laughs> semo, semo, semo is good. I'm, I, I can't take a class on nutrition. I'm not competent to do okay, so. Okay. But you see, those things that were in your body, to rust, that your body grew I, up I, with. I grew up eating a lubo. And yes. Those things are actually better for you because the system over the years has evolved to love to. those things. Mm -hmm. uh, so those other ones that are a bit stranger to them, even when they're delicious, all the giant Which pizzas, is why, of course, cut of colors. You know. They saw this spaghetti bolognese. This <laughs> 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 when I try, when I talk about this, I look for a Nigerian restaurant. Too. Oh, yeah. Is it uh, that draw soup? Or one of them? Vitamin soup? I, I, I remember, no, I remember my sister in law <laughs> no, in America. <laughs> um, and then she made, they said oh, they wanted to host us on mm. Christmas Day, special, you know all kind of dishes and, uh, and then they set the table i looked at the whole food all of them were strange <laughs> and then the one that uh, looked familiar was rice and then as soon as i took a spoon the food not done i just did my <laughs> wife was already <laughs> and, and they said how, how is it in fact the food was still in my mouth i was like mm, <laughs> delicious delicious i can relate you know? with what uh i didn't eat that food though. as talked about yeah but what I find um, not doable mm. is that government yeah. should come in and do us. <laughs> Go, and uh, do awareness. awareness. You know, government never creates awareness for their heads. Heads. Okay. 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 Yeah, okay. We cannot even advocate <laughs> for it. See, they're telling us to do this our security by ourselves. This is the reason why there are some airlines <laughs> that can enter traveling international. Uh, mm. They give you some uh, Jesus is Lord. grass to eat. And, There's, uh, I can't mention the airline. <laughs> Would they go? I was going to Dubai, but I had to get to Cairo first before going to Dubai. When they bring the food, I mm. not feel eat anything inside you. So this green, go beat you green, green, this one, I no, begin this, drink. This give me this, like, and they can't. Oh, and, and because of the flight, it, the, it gets some kind of drink with enough face serve. That it, so it was just, it was just some few. Give me juice. Give me this one. Give me that. One. It was just Ongago liquid. You know, you know. Funny enough, eh, what wakes me up in the morning is my. Boy movement. Mm. That's what right. wakes me up every morning yeah. because I try to run every morning like Jumoke riding bicycle. <laughs> but you find out that, and then once I go to the the, the restroom, mm. if I eat all this uh, mende mende, you know, I I hardly you know um, pass it easily. Pass, pass out. But when I eat garden egg, correct fruits, gari fruit care, gari. In the evening, say Meat. between what five soup? six. What soup? Ah man, I with uh, hey, maybe we will be vegetable. Vegetable or a uh, goosey granite so, soup. Mm. Uh, mm. Uh, mm. In helping so, Balao, your with his white bird. In helping his advocacy, this, yeah. the difference is that your body would, you know, quickly recognize food mm. that is organic. That is useful. so that is grown as opposed to processed food. You Not know, necessary. so your your Pasta and things like that. Things that are not grown will be different from natural fruits. Oh, definitely, yeah. definitely. The Advocate is better with your participation. It is now time to share some of the viewpoints on issues discussed here. Responding to the advocacy on Governor Sawolu's transportation work, M.O. Billions says, that is what makes for effective criticism, else it becomes merely political witch hunting. Kudos to you for giving accolades when due. Follow us on our social media platforms on Facebook Plus TV Africa, hashtag The Advocate NG, on Twitter and Instagram at Plus TV Africa, hashtag The Advocate NG. To catch up with previous broadcasts, go to plustvafrica.com slash The Advocate NG. After the break, Nedu is illustrating how successive governments in Nigeria use the promises of fighting corruption to hoodwink the populace in what he calls Comchopol. But Nedu, how does corruption sound in your own ears? Corruption sounds like corruption. <laughs> <laughs>